name is Sam Ravel, and I'm no Adam Bell, but I keep it in my name, y'all. This is your girl Sam Ravel, Adam Bell, and guess where I'm at? I'm at the airport. Guess where I'm going? I'm headed back to New York City to perform live at the Apollo Amateur Night. Okay, so if you watched my last video, you would see that I made it through. Yeah, I came third, but, you know, I was the only singer that made it through, so for me, I came first. You know, look at the glass. Half full, as opposed to half empty. So that's what I'm going to do. And anyway, so I'm headed back. But today, I'm going for the win. I'm performing tonight. I'm actually on standby. This time coming to New York City was really hard, like financially it was really hard. And I didn't think that I would even get here, but some nice person on Facebook gave me a buddy pass. And I, I paid a very small fee for it. And I appreciate that so much because now I'm here. I'm sitting here, though I don't have a seat as yet, I'm on standby. But from the looks of things right now, I don't know, the flight might not be full, so I might get on. But I'll let you guys know if I do. Or if I don't, but if I don't, I have to go see if I'll get on another, the next flight and so on and so forth. And hopefully I'll be there in time. I don't have to be there from rehearsal until 4 o'clock. It's 6, it's actually not even 6 o'clock yet. It's like 5.30 a.m. So I have a lot of time. The flight is two hours. So I will keep you guys up to date all day on what it is that I'm doing. I'm going to try my best to get more footage than I did the last time because I really didn't get any footage. I don't plan on going downtown to Times Square because financially, honestly, I can't. Like, yeah. <laughs> Let's just say I'm running on faith right now. But, you know, I have faith in God and the universe and I know that everything is going to work out and I'm going to be A-OK. -okay. I had to do my own nails. Not bad, right? I had to do what I had to do. I wanted to get them done, but it's in that annoying sound. Like, come on, man. Anyway, y'all, bye for now. Should I talk about the horrible experience I just had at the Hamptons Hotel here in New York? Hamptons LaGuardia to be exact. I'm a hashtag the sheep. Hampton in LaGuardia. I'm gonna tell y'all how this shit went down. Oh, 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 oh. Can't nobody love me better. Give y'all a sight of the streets as you be walking. Call them y'all. Good no. All right. I'm glad that he sees me. <laughs> he says, "I see you, baby. I see you." I'm glad he sees me, cause that would be real massive if he didn't. He'd probably walk straight into me. This is what I just took up, right? Look at that. Look at that. It's like absolutely nothing. Let's see how much yeah, this is going to cost. How much does it cost? How much does it cost? That's a lot for that little bit. $4.87 plus tax. Hey y'all, I tried to vlog as much as I could today. So, uh, I am ready and I'm ready to go on stage. So, I'm gonna show you guys what I'm wearing. I don't know if I like my outfit a lot, but it is what it is. I've worn this before. So, I'm gonna let you guys see my outfit. Anyway, so I'm dressed and I'm ready. And yeah, I'm not too crazy about my outfit selection. I'll try to let you guys see it, but I'm the second adult that's performing. I'm not excited about that either, but it is what it is. I'm going to go on stage and do my best that I can do. So yeah, it's part two. Mm -hmm. Theater. 
my um, song is going to be Love on the Brain that I really don't know that well, but I'm going to do my best anyway. That's the only thing That is just Just too little But Hey, I know y'all may be looking at me like, oh, she looks a little tired. It's because I am. I have officially been awake for three, for two and a half days, and I'm headed back to Atlanta. So you guys want to find out about last night? Okay, last night at the Apollo. Guess what happened? Drum roll. Boom. I did not make it through. Yeah, you know, let's just be real. Like, there could only be three winners and there were seven adults. I made it through the first time. And I didn't make it through this time. I thought I should have won, but hey. <laughs> Those were not in the cards for me, but that's fine. Um, how I felt about it, I was good with it. Um, the Apollo has always been a dream of mine since I was a child, and I was able to perform it twice this year. So that's a major accomplishment, and for me, if I could do that <laughs> twice in one year, can you imagine what your girl could do next year? Like, next year, I plan to take all the worlds. But yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be, yeah, I'm gonna still keep pushing, like, that's not going to deter me. I'm not going to be like, oh, my God. I'm not going to have a pity party and be like, oh, my God. I'm such a failure because I'm a winner in my eyes. I won. I'm a winner. And, yeah. So, yeah. I'm, I got a buddy pass ticket because, you know, tickets were expensive. There was a lot of money that went into coming to these competitions here in New York. So, um... I'm on a buddy pass, and unfortunately, yesterday was lucky I, I got there on the first flight. That was early. Yeah, I got there in time, but now that I'm headed home and I'm really tired, can't get on the flight. I had to put like a little ding in my eyes so that I can look like I'm awake, but I am so tired, y'all. Y'all have no idea. I am so sleepy, but yeah, comes to my end here in New York City. I will be back because I love this. I love it. I, I love Harlem. And I plan to move here one day. Oh, my God. I have a stalker. Two weeks now, I have a stalker. Somebody's been texting me from random numbers every day, a different number, texting me bits and pieces of my life. I don't know why, but I think it's my wife. I mean, who would know these things about me? Hmm. If it's not her, it's someone she told my business to... But that's another video. But if you do want to find out about that story, you can say it down below and I make a video and tell you about the story. Trust me, it's a very interesting story. Very, very interesting. Okay. So since I'm just gonna be sitting around the airport until I get a flight, I'm just gonna go down. I'm just gonna walk. So I think I need to get me some coffee. I'm just trying to avoid it, but you girl is tired. And I need a boost of energy. So that's what I'm finna do. These people are so fucking nasty. Like, ugh. This dude fucking just come. He just fucked. Like, he did not cover his mouth. Like, he's just so nasty. Breakfast. Can I get breakfast? I'm hungry. Should I get breakfast? Nah, I'm not. So, I didn't get on that flight until around, uh, yeah, I got on the second flight, which is like 8 o'clock, so I didn't get done at the airport till around 12, 
I didn't get home until around 12, 1 o'clock. Um, I ended up, I couldn't find my bag because my bag came ahead of me. And I had the wrong ticket for my first, when I first arrived to LaGuardia. I had that ticket, but I didn't have the ticket for when I got to Atlanta. So I walked and walked and walked and walked and walked. And finally I found my bag. It was in Atlanta. And then I took the train and I came home. And now I am laying in bed. I'm going to go to sleep. And New York was a success even though I didn't win. But it was a wonderful experience. Thank you guys for watching my video. But now it's time for me to go night night.